The Staffordshire Bull Terrier is an absolutely incredible breed, known for their courageous nature, intelligence and love for companionship with their family. You may be watching this video as you are looking into getting a Staffy pup, but as a first time dog owner, you're concerned about whether this is the right breed for you. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you whether or not this loving breed is a good choice as your first dog. Staffy Show, if this is your first time here, my name's Hattie. I'm a certified canine leader here at Fenrir CanineLeaders.com. This channel is dedicated to helping you learn everything you could possibly want to know about the Staffordshire Bull Terrier, then how to become high level canine leaders that can raise the perfect Staffies. So if you're a lifelong Staffy lover thinking about getting one or you've just started your journey with your new Staffy pup, then this is the channel for you. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a future Staffordshire Bull Terrier video. So let's dive right into today's video and find out whether or not the popular Staffy is good for a first time dog owner. There are many things to consider before bringing a puppy into your home, especially if this is your first ever experience of having your own dog. Savage Bull Terriers have not always had the best reputation as a breed due to originally being bred to fight other dogs. But what people do not always realize is that the Staffy is actually not a dangerous breed at all. They are bold and courageous dogs, but they are reliable, loving and loyal dogs that long for companionship with their owners. As with all dog breeds, you are required to provide them with lots of socialization from a younger age with strangers and other animals for them to grow into good natured and well-rounded adult dogs. Although they need quite a bit of care and attention, they are an incredibly good choice for a first-time dog owner that's after a dog that is loyal and affectionate. When these dogs are well-bred, well-trained and well-socialized from a young age, they are a real pleasure to have around due to their good nature and people-orientated personalities. Staffies love your attention and long to show you just how much you mean to them through their loving and devoted nature. They are known to be very kind and tolerant towards children of all ages as long as they have plenty of socialization to get used to how they are expected to behave. As with all dogs and young children, you should never leave them unattended. They can be slightly boisterous at times when playing, so this is very important to be aware of if you are someone who has very young children. The Staffy is an intelligent breed, and when they're well-bred and in the right hands, they can be quite easy to train. This is provided that their owners can match their intelligence and be firm, as a Staffy can test the limits as to how far they can go. It is common for this breed to have a slightly stubborn element in them, which means you need lots of patience to consistently train your pup. Hey guys, sorry to interrupt the video. I wanted to quickly let you know, if you didn't know already, that I have a completely free course called The Principles to the Perfect Puppy. In that course, I break down all of the most important things that I think you absolutely have to know and understand for you to become a high-level canine leader that raises your own perfect canine companions. So if you want to go and check out my completely free three principles to the perfect puppy course there'll be a link down in the description box below thousands of people have taken that and had incredible success so i can't wait to see you over there again there'll be a link in the description box below i'll see you on that course you should train your staffy with a firm but gentle hand as although they are a strong will breed they are also pretty sensitive in nature their love for their human companions makes them extremely eager to please you they benefit greatly from knowing who their leader is and their place in the pack they can easily develop unwanted bad habits and destructive behaviours if they're not trained properly and consistently from puppyhood. Again, socialising your dog from puppyhood will help them when training as they will be much more manageable and once you have their attention, they will listen and learn. Although the Staffy's living personality is a very positive quality, it does have a challenging element which may need your daily routine to adapt depending on your lifestyle. The Staffordshire Bull Terrier is an incredibly people-orientated dog breed and does not tolerate being left on their own and can even suffer from separation anxiety. Their sensitivity and strong devotion to their beloved human companions can cause this, so if you're looking for a dog that could be left alone, the Staffy is not going to be the breed for you. you you can train your dog to be left alone for very short periods of time as long as you start this training from a young age. A Staffy's high intelligence means that they need to have lots of mental stimulation to prevent any destructive behaviours from developing. They are a high energy, active breed that need a minimum of one hour of energetic exercise each day. The more exercise that you are able to give your Staffy, the more relaxed they will be in the home having released their energy on a long walk. They are impressively athletic dogs with a muscular build and they have actually been known to easily jump tall fences without much effort at all. Being intelligent dogs, they also need a lot of mental stimulation to prevent boredom, which, as an owner, you will need to be able to provide. If you're looking for a dog that can fit into your already active lifestyle, then the Staffy may be a great choice for you, as long as you can train and socialise them as they need. It's super important to do lots of research before making your final decision when getting your puppy, so we highly recommend watching more videos and reading up about the breed. Overall, the Staffordshire Bull Terrier is well suited to first-time dog owners that are willing to give the dog the care and focus training that it requires. They are incredibly loving and can make for a great great family companion with a high amount of socialization. If you're looking for an active companion that also loves to just spend time with you, then the Staffy may be a great first choice for you. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If so, make sure you hit that like button, get involved down in the comment section below, and don't forget that if you're new,
new here, so make sure you subscribe. We have two dedicated Staffy videos coming here every week. And I can't wait to talk to you again on the next episode of the Fenrir Staffy Show.